uh, still trapping like Ubers, running with shooters, mm. live in the city that make millions off the computer, I'm an archaeologist, bitch, this clip long as a ruler, let a fuck nigga run up his ass, going to Buddha, I lie whatever his religion, drink so much champagne for the pain, I need a intervention, my nigga back in, it's his third time he been to prison, God just took one of my best friends, Lord knows I'm a really miss him, bro was battling with mental health, that shit will make you go Switch against yourself, hard. most times when a nigga giving up, he only got four to inches left, law, nigga trying to put Full of Kansas City, but it's hard to be authentic in a game with no standards in it. Niggas gangsta on the phones with flake out when the camera finished. Like a LLC, my niggas pull up and handle business. You a lame nigga, ain't part of the street nigga algorithm. Staying from random fellas, they pause salmonella. We starving, it's now or never. And my cliques all in the middle. killing them, Yeah. Niggas, hot dogs and tower sellers and the bleachers. Don't want none of you rap niggas features. Big smoke, 76, the tools reaching. Fuck nigga. Shout yo, out to Tommy Guns. Yo, man. Tom G, man. That's where you start the podcast. Hey, welcome to the show, man. This is Bridge and the Rap Podcast, man. What this is? This is episode two. Episode two. This episode, this really like episode, what, 12? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We just had to work yeah, out we some had, kinks. Yeah, we had to work out a me? couple kinks. This, this is officially episode two, man. We, 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 we still at it, man. We had some shit getting our way, but we going, man. We going. Sir Say, what's up, bro? What up? D, how you doing, bro? And I'm good, man, you know. What's going on with you, man? Glad to be here, glad to, glad to be still kicking the way people dropping like flies this year, man. <sighs> man, that's crazy, bro. That's crazy, man. Um, Pop Smoke, you want to you just go straight to that or what? Should we? I was going to try to wait. I was going to try to wait, but we here now, so. Yeah, I mean. So if it, anybody who don't know right now, um, this is over the weekend. I believe so. Yeah, it's been it's it's been a few days now. Yeah, we recently just lost um, a young rapper, um, a promising rapper, um, Pop Smoke. He was killed. You good at um, doing this stuff better than me, yo? Uh, Cause so, you can run down the information a lot smoother than me. All right, well, Pop Smoke. Basically, if you didn't know, and let me just let me just be real right up front. I did not listen to Pop Smoke. I didn't know who he was until he died. We way we you know we way in Florida, a Florida based podcast. So we. We really wasn't on the, I guess they calling it uh, New York drill. Yeah, New York drill scene. We've so, heard about him. We've heard about it and right. heard about him, but we didn't. Uh, I didn't listen to him. I honestly didn't listen to him until he died. I know a lot of people get mad and call that uh, fake love or fake fan. It is what it is. But I like like I said, you gotta have the music. You know, you can't just die and then think you're gonna gain a bunch of fans if your music ain't there. And I have been jamming this music this past week, so I guess I'm one of the fake fans out of fake streamers. Yeah. Um, I think Christopher Walken. Gonna be one of the biggest songs of the year. When it pick up a before little steam. We, before we get there, I wanna, I wanna, cause we gotta handle this like people don't know what happened. Okay. You know what All I right. mean? And I thought you was you All right. that. So what happened was, uh, he had just got to L.A. Hollywood, uh, brought him a house, like a two point five million dollar house. He threw a party. From from what I'm reading, he was only in the house for about twenty four hours before uh, four assailants came. They went to the back door. Only one of them entered through the back door. The rest of them went back around the front of the house. And then they were all four seen leaving the house with nothing in their hand. Pop Smoke was the only one that got shot. Um, he took multiple shots to the torso and ended up dying at that famous L.A. hospital where a lot of people died. Uh, Cedar Sinai Hospital. Biggie died there. Easy died there. Uh, a few other people I can't think of right now. But... Uh, mm-hmm. Sad situation. He was only 20. He was coming up, had a whole different sound. Uh, I'm not saying he's the originator of it, but nobody else that had a major deal yeah, yeah. or that was on the radio sounded like bro yeah. sounded. And uh, I think I think it's a hot sound. I think it's a yeah. hot sound. It's a sad situation because he, he was nowhere near his peak. He had Spanish songs coming out. He's actually, uh, I think, Panamanian. I thought I, I saw Jamaican or something. He, got a, he had a Spanish song coming yeah. out, so okay. he got Spanish in him. But um, and they um they they said this all was like him uploading a picture of, like he was uploading a picture of his bags on social media and mm-hmm. his bags had happened to have, the address, to where to his house. That was one of the theories, but I actually. But think, he, then he also had that that party. He threw a party that yeah. night. The, di- the I night actually, he got I killed. actually just think somebody was after him for something. I think it's gonna come to the light eventually. I don't know if it had anything to do with that rape. You know, rape uh, or the wraith, wraith, the car, the Rolls Royce. Yeah, then I uh, took somebody's car, 
And, and they said the next, they was only supposed to use it for a day. That was back in New York, right? That happened I, in New York? I think it was in Cali. Okay. But he took the car back to New York. Or vice versa, one of the ways. Um, but basically, he was only supposed to use the car one day for a video shoot. When the owner called the next day to get the car back, say he hit him with a New York lingo. Suck my dick, bitch. Oh, man. <laughs> and uh, it went from there. He ended up getting arrested for it, you know. So wow. I, don't, I don't know what it's about. But I, I don't know if it was about the address. That was kind of like the internet, the initial internet theory yeah, around yeah, yeah, the yeah. big death is usually wrong. Yeah. You know like, what I'm just saying? Like, just like, like. Kanika um, Jenkins then. Yeah, that was crazy. I, I remember arguing with niggas about that shit for months. <laughs> but but um, just like just like this situation with Pop Smoke, like um, people was claiming that his brother had set him up. Like yeah. Pop Smoke uploaded the picture of the that had about the bags that had the address on it. Right. But people ran with the um whole story of that his brother had uploaded the picture, and right. they thought it was a setup on Pop Smoke. Then they went to the, they went to his brother's Instagram page and started like just going in on him about like. Right. You know what I mean? Just it's internet, the whole, they call internet them, they call detectives. Them internet detectives. <laughs> they the worst. I don't even think. Have they ever done anything that was like the internet detectives? Have they done anything that made sense? Have like, they ever solved anything? I don't think so. I think people they, be so caught up in these, like they be watching these criminal minds and they watching these 448s and they just be trying to put puzzles together they didn't even know. And, and then the worst part about the internet detective is it's not always about the facts. They they feel the freedom to throw conspiracies in there with no proof, <laughs> no lineage or nothing to connect the dots. You know what's funny? You know what's funny? Like they, they come up with these stories and they get so caught up in them, right? And then some 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 opposing news come in that 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 throw they they ideal away and they be like, nah, nah, nah hell no. Nah. That's fake. That's BS. <laughs> hell no, I don't believe that. They took that girl organs. I know it, dog. <laughs> Rest in peace, Kanika Jenkins, not yeah, making light of the Kanika situation. But the internet, internet detectives get crazy with it. Bro, man. I remember, bro, since you don't brought up Kanika Jenkins, you remember like they had the whole video of her just like basically like drunk walking, with sleep right. walking. They had the whole video of her. And, and people was claiming it was a ghost. It was edited. It was edited and it was people walking her. It was and a ghost. That's when I got left the internet theories alone because <laughs> are you going to say that her friends did it? So you're telling me these 17, 18, 19 year old Chicago thugs Broke into a computer system, edited they self out, <laughs> and put the camera back before the police saw it. Okay, that's how I went down. <laughs> this bitch, bitch look at you and say, "Yeah, yeah, for real." <laughs> but yeah, but but with Pop Smoke, man, Pop Smoke, um, he was he was um, it seemed like he was loved. A lot, lot of people, of uh, a lot of people felt that felt that him being getting killed. And dog, like that, that was one dog. Like it's always the ones that you don't see coming. Just like with Kobe, rest in peace Kobe, like the ones that you don't see coming, mm -hmm. it's like it, it makes you recognize your own, like your own faith. Like you, you're gonna have to die one day and it yeah. can just come at any time. Your own mortality. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And it's yeah. like, fuck man. Yeah. So that's that's always sensitive for people too, man. You know what I mean? So he was like, he was he was so loved because he was finally going to bring New York back. Yeah. Like he was one of the first yeah. new, new York artists in years that was 110% New York. You didn't yeah. have to ask where he was from. Like, you look at 6 9 you look at a guy like Jay Critch, you look at A Boogie. They don't really have an authentic New York sound. Yeah. He came with like 50 Junior, dog. Yeah. Like he's like a new 50 Cent. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, um, yeah, man, just, just a very unfortunate situation. Um, I wish I, I wish him and his family, his friends, all the best, and I hope they um, I mean, I hope they get through it okay. Um, like I said, man, it's 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 hard, man. Like you know, what I mean, you know, death, death never, you never know when it's coming. But like, I don't know with social media now, dog. You like, feel like it's a cultural issue. A cultural issue? Nah, not not that. I'm just talking about like how, because I think a, it had a a lot of like what shot people a lot of times is like. You don't never see it like you, we we sit up we sit up and open unlock our phones and go to Instagram all the time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And then it's just that one time you go and you be like, "Damn, pop smoke, guy. what?" And it just fuck with you for a little minute. You yeah, know what I mean? It definitely did. It messed with me for a couple of days. <laughs> uh, just the way uh, Triple X death messed with me for a couple because they young with dudes, me too, dog. dog. They young Man, that, dudes. That fuck with me too, dog. Because like like my son used to like um, Triple X for whatever reason. Like he mm -hmm. used to want to get his hair dyed like him and stuff like that. And um like. You know what I mean? Like, I'm trying to bond with my son. I'm listening to Triple X with him. We in the car <laughs> listening to it and shit like that. And singing the songs together and stuff like that. And then, like, you know what I mean? You open your phone and DJ Academic say he got shot. And it's like, yeah. I know you lying, bro. You lying. You know what I mean? It just, it just fuck with you, man. You remember it was conspiracies around that death, too. They basically ended the JIT career. 
Yeah. Because he had a red mask <laughs> going on his page. Yeah, what was that kid? What, Taser, uh, sir said, what was that kid name? Who used to wear the fucking little uh, things that the women wear from the health store? Yeah. What the fuck Me is his too. name? You know. What is what a shorty name? Shout out to him, man. Yeah, shout out to Jit, man. I forgot his name. I'm sorry, man. But yeah, man. Um, but like, man, like, like, um, I'm, I'm done with like, man. I'm almost done with rap and like rappers getting killed, man. Like, we don't, you don't see it in no other genre like this, man. Probably yeah. at all, at all, bro. Yeah, Jim Jones just got in a big argument with a soldier online because he said that being a rapper is like as bad as being a soldier. Overseas or something. And uh soldier took a literal, I'm offended that you would say that, we'll do. But hey, Jim Jones replied and made big points. He's like, you made a choice to go over there. You're talking about your fellow soldiers that died that you met two months ago. Everybody I grew up with is either dead or in jail trying to be in the music business. Yeah. So he, he had a lot of good points. It's just, it's just a terrible, just a terrible atmosphere in hip hop where like everybody reacted as not saying, "Wow, this shouldn't happen." They reacted as saying, "Like, damn, he should have yeah. had his mans with his guns yes, there, bro. so it could have been a war." Yo, like, man, and it's like that. That's what bothered me too, man. Like, I, I go on social media and I see a bunch of bunch of people like saying, like, um, they blaming it on the record labels. They saying the record labels are are signing people, hoping that they die so they can make a quick buck off them when they die. Like, because you know, like he, his streams went up like mm-hmm. so much of times, like. Multiplied yeah. by so many times since his death, and it's like that don't make sense to me. You know what I mean? Because like that's just one small period in time. Like I don't. They yeah. can make more if like the record label is not trying to get Pop Smoke killed. They can make way more money with him just being alive mm-hmm. instead of just that one period in time where he, he got a little bump, like well, a little if you, peak. If you let them tell it, that's what was the Tupac situation. Somebody actually making a movie right now trying to insinuate Tupac is alive in Mexico. Black people need to stop, bro. Black yeah. people need to stop, man. <laughs> what the fuck yeah. going on? And and defense of my black people, you know, we white people was the same way about Elvis. Uh Elvis Presley. Oh yeah. Yeah, they they matter of fact, if you back in middle school, we was like in middle school at the time and Tampa made national news because there was a doctor in Tampa that called all these news stations swearing up and down that one of their patients was Elvis using a different name. And it was like this white dude with white hair, older white dude with like real white hair. Like, yeah. This is Elvis Presley right here. You know, he's just using a different name. They couldn't <laughs> let that go. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times when a superstar dies, it's hard to let it go. Yeah, man. You be, you be like, we, we, we love our, we love our stars so much, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like, like I just said, like with the Kobe situation, like that fucked a lot of people up. That was, that was tough. Bro. You know what I mean? Like the amount of love for Kobe and then like, you know what I mean? You just open your phone one day and you see that Kobe dies. Like, hell nah. Like what the fuck? It fucks you up, man. It fucks you up. Um, Every time I shoot a shot people, now, people, Kobe. People did something with that too. Yeah. With the conspiracy oh, yeah. shit, didn't they? Especially <laughs> especially Dr. Umar Johnson. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, this nigga, man. This nigga, bro. We got to come up with a name for that nigga on our show. A nickname for that nigga on our show. You know who Umar is, sir? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, um, man, where was I at? I forgot where I was at. Oh, how they came up with a uh, conspiracy for the Kobe death. What was it? You good at remembering this stuff. I can't remember. I know Umar Johnson was saying something about Kobe being in a legal battle with a big pharmaceutical company for the rights to the name Black Mamba. So that's that was Umar theory. And, and they finna kill Kobe. Of course, after he gave his theory, he said, that's why y'all need to donate to this school right now. Hit, it, hit up my inbox. I got my Patreon and my PayPal in my bio. Dog, them niggas is the worst, bro. Like, real shit. Them yeah. niggas is the worst, bro. You, you take this opportunity to try to get donations. Mm-hmm. Come on, bro. You the yeah. scum, nigga. Yeah. You was really a scum, bro. They ain't no different than the than than preacher that's preaching for the cash in your pocket. That's why they talk about preachers and religion so much. Because they want to separate themselves when really they want to. You selling hope, bro. Selling hope, just like Joel Olstein or whatever his name yeah. is. They got the big church in Texas, but when the flood came, nobody was allowed to come to his church. Selling hope, man. They, God, they're they're so praying strong, on bro. people's fears. Yeah, man. Want to add anything else to this morbid part of the show? I didn't, 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 didn't want to open smoke. the show so morbid. That's why I wanted to get to it later. Yeah, dog. <laughs> R.I.P. Pop Smoke, and I'm finna go go find me the cheapest Dior shoes I can find. <laughs> 